What's up, Falcons Nation? It's your boy, Jew, coming at you with another Atlanta Falcons video. As always, Falcons Nation, rise up. In today's video, I would like to talk about defensive coordinator Dean Pease, but if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you know when I've done Atlanta Falcons content. Uh, hit that like button for your boy. I do appreciate each and every one of you guys for your continued support, uh, continuing to share out my content on all the social media platforms. If you'd like to follow your boy on Twitter and Instagram, you can follow me at Jutalk Sports. Um, if you would like to donate to my channel, you can donate to my cash app, which is the dollar sign Jutalk Sports. And if you'd like to be a part of my Jutalk Sports membership, uh, you can hit that join tab here on the channel as well. Uh, but with that being said, um, let's jump right into the video. So as I mentioned uh, in today's video, I do want to talk about defensive coordinator Dean Pease. And will he return uh, next season in 2023? Um, if you haven't heard, yesterday Dean Pease did have um, his weekly press conference. And he basically stated that he's not too sure if he's going to return next season. That he needed to talk to his wife and he needed to talk to his family. Uh, Dean Pease is now 73 years young. And basically he stated that, um, you know, being that he's getting up there in age, um, that he wanted to talk to his family first to find out, um, you know, how they feel about him coaching next season. Um, personally, I hope that Dean Pease comes back next season. Um, being that Dean Pease now has laid the foundation uh, in these first two years uh, with our defense, um, I hope that he gets to come back and enjoy the fruits of his labor. Um, I feel like him and Arthur Smith has done a great job. This coaching staff has done a great job of laying down the uh, the foundation uh, to build a winning uh, organization, to build that winning culture. Um, as you know, Dean Pease is a defensive coordinator that likes to pressure, bring pressure like the blitz and things of that nature. Um, and he's won multiple championships uh, since he's been in the NFL as a defensive coordinator. And I really would like to see Dean Pease um, get this Atlanta Falcons defense at least uh, into like the top 10 or top 15 defenses in the league. That's been his goal since he stepped foot in Atlanta was to get this team um, towards the top in the league in defense. Um, it didn't come to fruition in his first two seasons, uh, being that we didn't have a lot of money um, that we could spend um, due to our, our salary cap basically being in salary cap hell. We couldn't uh, really build the defense uh, like we really wanted to. Uh, Terry Fontenot didn't have money, a lot of money to spend to bring in those big name free agents. Um, so basically all we had was the draft and we only were able to bring in guys on like one year deals. But I really think that Dean Pease did a great job with using um, both him and Terry Fontenot using the things, the money that we had. They brought in guys like Rashawn Evans, who's really played well at that linebacker position. Um, you know, he moved. Isaiah Oliver around from nickel to safety in a lot of different positions. Um, he's gotten the best out of the star players on this defense in Grady Jarrett and A.J. Terrell. But I really would like to see Dean Pease come back at least one more season because the Falcons will have money to spend in free agency this year for the first time since this regime has been here. I really would like to see Dean Pease uh, come back and, like I said, enjoy the fruits of his labor. Um, he's put in the time in these last two years with these guys, with the young guys that we've had. We've drafted um, a lot of defensive players, uh, Ogan Deji, um, AK, Arnold Evacati, um, D'Angelo Malone, uh, Troy Anderson. We've drafted a lot of young players uh, the last two seasons since Dean Pease has been here uh, due to us not having the money to spend in free agency. And I feel like Dean Pease has done a solid job um, of, you know, teaching these guys the scheme, teaching these guys the system. And at this point, I really think that bringing Dean Pease back will be huge for continuity. Um, I really believe in having continuity uh, in an organization where players, you know, know what this uh, know what to expect out of the coaching. And I really think if he comes back for one more season, this Falcons defense could definitely be a top 15 defense um, if we bring in the right players in the draft and if we bring in the right players in free agency. But Dean Pease, to me, even though we haven't 
uh, had a top 15 defense. Um, I really don't think that that's been due to his play calling on defense. Um, I really think it has a lot to do with us having a lot of young players and also us not being able to, you know, spend money in free agency. So we kind of have had to patch this thing together. Um, we haven't had um, he hasn't had the ability to bring in, you know, big name guys to come in and help this defense. So as at some point, you only can call so many great, you know, great play calls. At some point, the players got to go out there and execute the game plan. And I think that these guys, for the most part, has done a solid job uh, in the first year. Um, in both uh, both seasons, we haven't really given up a lot of explosive plays. Um, and that's something that Dean Pease always harps on is taking the ball away and not giving up explosive plays. And I feel like this defense have done a, sell, a solid job um, of not allowing the explosive play. Um, the This coaching staff has done a great job of teaching these guys the, funda uh, the fundamentals of the game. Uh, the Falcons um, as a whole, both on offense and defense this season, um, we the, we're the least penalized team in the NFL. And to me, that, te uh, that tells me that this uh, team is a well-coached team. So with that being said, I do want to get you guys' thoughts on Dean Pease possibly coming back next season. Do you think that Dean Pease will come back next season? I sure hope he comes back, like I said, where he can benefit uh, from ha for having better players on defense, having more playmakers on defense. But he's done a spectacular job uh, just at teaching these guys the fundamentals, teaching these guys the scheme, and basically getting the most out of the players that he's had. So with that being said, this being your boy, Ju, you guys let me know what you think of the video. Um, give me your thoughts on Dean Pease. Do you think he comes back next season? Um, like I said, I'm not too sure if he will. Uh, selfishly, I do want him to come back. So hopefully his family allows him to come back for one more season, uh, possibly make a playoff berth with the Atlanta Falcons. But with that being said, this being your boy, Ju, I'll holler at you guys in the next video. As always, Falcons Nation, rise up. Peace.